I'm going to show you how to take that vinegar smell out of your pickle jars and your lid. Uh, it's easier to get it out of the jar, but not so easy to get it out of the lid. But if you take baking soda and water, and I've already put this in the jug. I've already swirled it up a little bit. I'm going to swirl it up a little bit more. And make sure you, when you get, take it out, you rinse it really well. But uh, just make, I added a little bit of water and I'm going to make a paste in here. And I've already got a little bit of water in there. And make sure that you go all the way around here, around the edges. And make sure you do the paste. I'm sorry it's hard to do and hold the phone too. But you're just going to make a paste in here. And once you get it all stirred up, and make sure you get it around that ring really, really well. And you just let that sit here for a few minutes. Uh, as we know, baking soda is an order, odor absorber. But we'll take this and swirl it around a little bit. I've already swirled it some. So just make sure it gets all in there. And you can let that sit for a few minutes before you rinse it just to make sure you get all the odor out. There's probably a little bit of remains in there. But uh, you'll just uh, rinse this out. Rinse it out really well. Rinse it nice and clean again. And we're going to rinse this out. Like I say, it's hard to do with just one hand. Of course, I'll rinse it out better when I have two hands to do it with. But uh, I just wanted to show you that that's a good way to do this. And get the odors out of your pickle jar. And I'm actually going to put... Uh, coffee beans in mine that's why I wanted to really make sure that was out uh, but this is a pretty good idea uh, you try it and let me know what you think and subscribe and comment and give me your thoughts on it thank you